It was a lot of fun, to be completely honest, but it was it was just like odd dancing, and basically any dancing I do is odd dancing, so that wasn't that surprising. Uh, it, it's, it's not super complicated. It's not on PC. It's only on mobile, so maybe it's not applicable to you, but if you have a girlfriend or a girl you're trying to get interested in you, maybe not a bad idea to try it out. We're gonna move on now. Then we come to Anamnesis. This is probably the most creative use of Oculus Rift I've seen ever, not only at E3 this year, but ever. And it's kind of interesting because you are a FEMA agent that is investigating the, the missing reports of people from a quarantine area. You're not sure where they went. And you have to see things from your eyes. So you go into their apartment and you look at their lives from what it is now, but then you use the Oculus Rift as kind of like a sort of spy goggles, which gives you the power to see the like psychic resonance that's still in the apartment. And you can see what they saw at that point in time. It's a very interesting game. It's not gonna be a high fast game, it's not action, it's none of those kind of things, but if you're into investigations and criminal kind of stuff and you wanna like go in and see what people were like and kind of figure things out, this might be a game for you. Last but not least is Hack and Slash, a game that allows you to literally hack the game you're playing and doesn't ban you for it, which is fantastic. You can change pretty much everything in the game. You can walk up to a bush and make it drop 100 hearts, which will heal you 100 times, which is ridiculous, or you can change a foe's alignment to be friendly if you want. You can do pretty much anything you want it's fantastic and if you find it daunting that you might have to do programming in a game don't worry about it it holds your hand enough while not dumbing itself down that it's real a really good experience and in late game you'll get to like literally reprogramming part of the runtime of the game but you'll be ready for it it'll be okay Thank you guys for watching. If you guys want to see more E3 coverage, be sure to subscribe to Linus Tech Tips. Also, be sure to subscribe to NCX Com as we'll have at least one more of these videos coming. And thanks to NCX for always being our trusted source for gaming PCs. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.